before we dive deeper uh, into the fraud trends, uh, I want to start from the sharing the uh, experience on what types of fraud is there. Because sometimes when we like uh, someone hears fraud, uh, everyone has different contexts. So basically, we divide fraud into four main categories. Uh, the one, uh, the one of them is uh, traffic fraud. So basically, it's uh, spoofing, it's emulating fake devices, uh, it's uh, switching geos, and uh, many, many more. So this all connects to that we don't have uh, real users, but uh, all of them are being emulated. And uh, I will tell you more about that later. Okay, uh, for the payment fraud, uh, it connects more to the direct advertisers. So um, many of you may see that uh, the users, the clients who are uh, getting on board to, on your product, they may be using fake credit cards, doing the chargebacks. Uh, that could be like a referral fraud where someone takes your referral link and uh, uses it again and again. So this is all about the payment fraud. Uh, bonus abuse. So some of the products uh, provide the welcome bonus when you sign up. And uh, of course, if uh, you are able to make some money on it, some fraudsters are finding the way to uh, sign up uh, a lot of accounts, do some like basic uh, fraudulent activity to show you that uh, something is happening for them to get those bonuses. And the uh, lead fraud uh, also for the CPL, uh, cases whenever the advertisers are paying for the signups, for example, single opt-in, uh, double opt-in, so uh, all those leads are uh, also uh, can be generated by the fraudsters.